Jennifer here with Press Pass LA. Thanks for joining us back on the red carpet. We are here tonight for HBO's new show, Here and Now, starring Holly Hunter and Tim Robbins. So, Peter, congratulations. Obviously, this looks like an amazing show. I'm curious, so you're starring and you're producing in it. Tell us what it's like to wear both hats, because they're very different. Uh, they're very, very different, but it's very, very difficult. It's a lot of hard work. It's long, long hours. As a producer, you have to be on top of everything from hiring writers, hiring directors, casting, uh, uh, music, uh, score, editing, post. Uh, I mean, you name it, being on the set, dealing with everything. So it's a big job. Uh, once I've dealt with the show as a producer, I found out how easy actors have it. Because as an actor, you have a role you focus on. You memorize the lines, you do the research that is necessary, and you show up, basically. As a producer, it's like a non-stop job. Hi, Marwan. So thanks for stopping with us. Congrats. It's the premiere of your show. Tell us what it was like kind of finding out that, you know, you've gotten cast in this big HBO show, Tim Robbins, Holly Hunter. What was that feeling like? I mean, it was just... It, it's crazy. Everything just changed in one day, you know? Like, you're waiting for this for this decision and then and then it happens and then you're on set with Holly Hunter and Tim Robbins and all these awesome people and you get to um, show the story you know and 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 so, something so unique and something so different than everything else that's out there so it's amazing hi congratulations on your premiere tonight uh, tell us a little bit about what we can expect from your character this season Kristen let's see she's young she's figuring it out she is naive about a lot of things and then she makes a pretty pretty cool transformation and learns a lot throughout the season um, and she's super kooky she's got a lot of personality and she's honestly just a fun girl to play so tell us about what it's been like you know joining this cast and this new show which touches upon a lot of you know timely issues yeah I would say I'm going to separate from the issues in a, for a moment and just talk about what it's like to join this cast. Um, I have a whole new family, and that that like that touches my heart, and that's that's really wonderful. So that's it's you 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 hope for that. You hope for that in a work experience, in our work experience at least, right? And and to have that is to have that happen is just beautiful. Hi, Joe. So we are here. It's your big night. It's the premiere. Congratulations. Tell us a little bit about your role as Malcolm in this show. Okay, uh, yeah, I play Malcolm Collins. I'm married to Ashley, and we have a four-year-old daughter named Haley, uh, who's the cutest thing you're ever going to see. Um, and Malcolm is he's a really good guy. He's a solid guy. He's a dependable guy. What happens with Malcolm is he's got a few blind spots. He's got a few... He's got a few areas where he doesn't realize that maybe maybe the world hasn't treated other people the same as it's always kind of treated him. So those start to rear their head as the season progresses. So hi, Fernanda. We're here at the premiere of your show. Congratulations, first of all. Tell us a little bit about what it was like, you know, finding out that moment that you've been cast in this big HBO project. It's like a dream come true, I'm sure. Oh, yeah, it was a dream come true. I think I just kept saying I can't believe it for a while. Um, I think we all have had those moments that, you know, Wow, we're really, we're really doing this. We're really a part of this thing that's so special. And I, I don't think anybody that's a part of this has lost sight of that at any moment. It's something that we're constantly remind ourselves of. Hi, Nakar. Nice to meet you. So congratulations, premiere of your show. It looks like it's going to be amazing. Tell us what it's like for you as an actor to be a part of this show. I have enjoyed being a part of this show so much. I'm a huge fan of Alan. I'm a huge fan of all of his work. This work is no different. I am a huge fan of it, as well as you know, being a member of the cast. And uh, it's been, we've worked really hard, we've had a lot of fun. Every player in this is just top, top notch. I've, it's been a real privilege to be a part of it. All right, so Andy, congratulations. You're here on the premiere, so big night for you. Tell us a little bit about your role in the show. Uh, yeah, no, I'm uh, kind of like, uh, Henry's a bit of a nomadic kind of um, wanderer and falls into uh, the uh, the arms of this uh, beautiful man, uh, Ramon, played by Danny Zavato, and uh, kind of a relationship starts to take on in a, in a, in a kind of a, um, a strange way, kind of that's like the, the show, everything, every relationship's a little uh, unique, uh, unique of its own, and uh, yeah. 
Well, congratulations on the show. It looks amazing. Tell us a little bit about, you know, what your journey has been with it from the moment you found out that, you know, you were going to be in it. And it's, I'm sure it's like an actor's dream. Yeah, man. I mean, look, I'm a kid from Costa Rica. You know, I, I moved here. I wanted to do this. And now I'm here with Tim, who's right there, and Holly. And that's crazy. It, it really is. I mean, the process was, you know, like any other process, you audition and you work hard to get the part and then they call you and they tell you, no, you know, you got the part and you're like, what? Like, that's, not, that's not true. Um, and then it was better than I ever expected. I mean, like, you know, you're working with Oscar, Tony, Golden Globe, whatever winners and people that you admire and see their careers and want to emulate them. And then they turn out to be pillars. You know what I mean? Like, I have the most amazing examples of what you should be like on set, off set, and, and to work with that and learn that from them, it feels like I went to grad school, you know? Congratulations on your big night tonight here at the premiere. Tell us a little bit about your role in the film, in the, not the film, in the show. It feels like a film because, you know, when you have Alan Ball and Tim Robbins, yeah, too, it's shot like it does. The trailer alone, you may, it almost feels like a movie, but tell us about your role, and I know you can't give away a lot, but what we can expect over the season. Um, so my role's name is Mommy, um, so everybody on set's like, hey, Mommy, <laughs> but no, um, she's somebody that pieces a lot of things together and makes a lot of people question things within the story, so when you watch it, um, it's going to be a big surprise. Hi, Erin, congratulations. Tell us a little bit about what it was like, you know, I, want, I always like to ask actors this, what it was like, what? I like to ask actors this, you know, that moment when you got the phone call that you got the role of Wendy, yeah. like what did you do, who was the first person you called? Uh, I was at Martha's Vineyard, I was like boating with some friends, and my agent texted me saying I got the part, and I was so excited, I just like turned, I was in a restaurant eating lunch, and I turned to everybody and I was like, yes! And then people were like, what's going on, you know? And I was so excited because knowing that I was going to be working on such a well-written show for a, such a wonderful network, I was like, so... Dream come true, right? Really, it is. And then when I found out that the part was recurring, it's like, wow, like... How nice, you know? So it was really great. Well, that's a wrap on the red carpet. It was a great night here. We got to speak to Holly Hunter, Tim Robbins, and executive producer Alan Ball. We cannot wait to check out season one of Here and Now on HBO. Tune into the premiere this Sunday night.